So guys, welcome to the answers to test number 17. I gave you this chart. Shelly did actually. And this is uh, Aquarius Ascendant chart with Lord of the fourth house, okay, in the sixth house, with, along with the debilitated Mars. And I asked you, what does this really signify? What could happen? And, you know, some of you knew what you were talking about. And some of you kind of missed uh, the main thing. But overall, you guys kind of knew. It, this is, is signifying three more of the most important things. Number one, it signifies accidents, especially car, car accidents or anything that is motor vehicle related. It could be motorcycle, cars, boats, planes. Okay. Um, but more so, not planes, but more so things on the ground because Taurus represents Earth, Earth sign. Okay, so fourth house is Earth sign and it represents things of, uh, you know, on the plane. So why it signifies accident? Because first of all, fourth house is a significator of conveniency. A significator of happiness, land and conveniency. Conveniency can be anything. Conveniency can be vehicles. It can be being in a nice home. It could be in a, in a, staying in a luxurious hotels all the time. Just having all the luxuries of life. Like in summer, you will have air conditioner. When the winter comes in, you have the heat ready. Conveniency. And you're, it makes you happy. Okay. So that conveniency part goes into the sixth house. Sixth and eighth house. If fourth lord goes into the sixth house or eighth house, represents accident, especially with car and motorcycle. Now, this lord is now sitting with debilitated Mars. And Mars is a significator of accidents. So this definitely says that this person has to be very, very careful because they can get into a lot of accidents. Especially when their transiting Mars is going over this over this alignment, especially the exact conjunction, or when this same Mars is going over the moon in their horoscope. Okay, so that's number one, accidents. Number two, shows me constant heartbreaks in a relationship due to their own mishaps. What do I mean by that? Because whenever Mars and Venus comes into conjunction or aspect, it signifies a love marriage. But this combination is happening in the sixth house, which represents enemies, Okay, it represents deaths, diseases, and what happens is Mars is debilitated. That represents that male company, not a husband, but male company, that male energy, and it's debilitated. That means this person is going to run into all the wrong men in their life or wrong women in their life. But this is especially signifying for in a female's chart can signify is running into the wrong guy as far as the love is concerned. Okay, somebody, it could be somebody who's manipulative, cheater, abusive in their, in their life. Okay, third aspect that is happening here is that this represents sexually transmitted diseases. Because Venus represents sexually transmitted diseases along with Mars in the sixth house of diseases. Okay, and sexually transmitted diseases involves a lot of things. Now, Venus represents fertility. Fertility. fertility in uh, a human being if it's a female it represents her ovaries if it's a male it represents the sperm and so this is why it and since Nietzsche the debilitated Mars is with it in the sixth house represents those diseases being transmitted through sexual intercourse okay so these people have to be careful so guys this was my answer to test number 17 it was quite simple but it was quite important this is why I did that it was important for you to know. So what, if you have this uh, uh, combination, first of all, be very careful who you have sex with. Be protective all the time unless you get married with a person, unless you, you know, do your test and everything and you're clean. Only then do it. Okay. Uh, and then, um, second of all, um, make sure that when you drive your car, please drive carefully. And these people, especially this combination, want to drive fast. Do not drive fast. Drive carefully. Okay? And third of all, please be careful who you choose as your partner because they could turn out to be abusive. They could turn out to be people who could cheat on you. All right? So anyway, guys, if you're new to my channel, subscribe above. And if you want to know more about this stuff and astrology and learn about yourself, 
check out my link below check out my articles there read them all check out my book there astrology the speed of light and once you get the book i will send you the link to study your own chart but just make sure you follow the directions that are on my website thank you